Kelly Q with 1029 The Buzz, and I'm here with the rock personality, Mr. Matt Bishop. Matt, tell me a little bit about yourself. A little bit about me. Well, psh, I'm from Philadelphia, Bethlehem, Pennsylvania originally. Uh, went to college there. Uh, I've always loved rock and roll. That's why I'm here. Love interviewing bands, talking to people, hanging out with them, chilling. Um, you know, they're people just like us, so it's just cool to have a chance to actually just look them in the eye and talk to them, ask them questions, you know, about what they do, about their music. Because, um, you know, on stage, they're, they're so far away. And, you know, you can listen to their albums and watch them on TV, watch them on stage, but when you get, like, right here, like we are, that's the point where you're just like, yo, he's just another bro like I am. He just can play guitar better. <laughs> Nice. So I saw you getting a, a little frisky earlier with uh, some ladies on the red Wowzers carpet. Girls. That you, was wild. How was that? I wasn't expecting that. I was just kind of hanging, and we were waiting to interview Corn just now, and I guess their producer was like, "Entertain everybody," because like all the photographers nice. were here, and I got I got roped into it. I, I'm not really complaining. Though. I was going to say you look like you're enjoying it, and uh, some of the little. moves that they were doing on you. I mean. What guy would not like that, right? I've read about them on the internet. I didn't know that they could actually be done, but now I, they, it's true. So so what are you wanting to do? You, you interview and do that sort of thing. You travel around a little bit. What, what are some of your goals? What are you trying to do? Maybe who are you trying to work for? That sort of thing. I don't know if I have any particular goal as far as like who I work for. I just want to do my thing, do what I do. I just like to interview bands, talk to them. Um, because when you when you listen to music and you feel like you're a fan, then it's it's easier to interview. You know, I've I've done some interviews of you know not like rock and roll personalities, and you know I have to do research and prep, and I feel like it's very it can be very robotic. You know, once you get into it, you get to you know feel them out a little bit, and then it's cool. But um, with these guys, you know, like you know the Seether guys came up, Art of Dying, like I'm become like friends with them now almost every time they see me they're like yo I can't tell if it's because they like me or if they're just drunk all the time but um art of dying they were probably drunk yeah and uh you know you just you come up and it's just like hey man how's it going and you just you get make that connection you know so nice yeah. so here in Vegas at the 48 hour music festival what what's something that you've been doing in Vegas I mean partying every night I'm sure What's well, what's we an epic the, experience you've had so far? Don't tell people you're with me. It was, sorry, we were not. I'm kidding. I didn't we see aren't her at friends. All. I don't know who he is. Opposite ends of the strip. <laughs> um, the after party was pretty wild. It was at the House of Blues. It was pretty dope. A lot of the it's bands a good time. were there. Yeah, it was a great time. Um, you know, it's just good that everybody can just kind of get together. And I think that's the beauty of this whole festival is everybody is really like on the same level you know there's a lot of VIP access there's autograph signings and that's the way it should be you know a lot of one-on-one -on -one with kind of the fans yeah. and, and the artists yeah. and not to mention the artists I, I had a lot of artists mentions today that it was very much like a family reunion that most everybody had played with everybody and it was just mm -hmm. good I mean freaking Las Vegas to kind of get together to, to yeah. round out the year I know a lot of people I interviewed today I would ask them like hey who are you guys here to see and they would be like Shh. Oh my God! You know, name see their ten man. years, corn god smag, uh, art of dying, and they would just name everybody. They were like, yeah, you know, we just all got off tour together. A lot of the guys were on uproar festival together, so it's cool, you know. Good times. It makes for a good party. Mm -hmm. Definitely. Okay. Well, great, Matt. Thank you so much for hanging out and talking with me for a little bit. No problem. One hundred two nine the buzz. Check this guy out. He's gonna be doing big, great and things. And listen to the buzz. That's people. right. Buzz out. Nashville lights. <laughs> Rock and roll.